Hey everybody, this is Arathus and welcome back to Foundation. So we're basically trying to hit the weekly profit of 500 so we can actually move on to the next couple of building types. Unfortunately, it's taking a little while, longer than I thought it would. But we getting there. Slowly but surely, we're we're getting there. Come on. Probably gonna take a while. That's why I'm not building anything for a while. I just want to build the stone mason. That's kind of my big deal. Right this second. Because then I can finish making the tailor's workshop, and then my people can start buying clothing, and then my profits will really go up. I like how this one has nothing but, like, cloth and wool. Wish I could make clothing out of it, but I cannot. At least not at the moment. We're getting there, though. I have the 500, but I'm only at the 265. We still have to wait. I don't have bread to give. <laughs> I'd like to give you bread. I really would. <clears throat> I have no reason to not want to give you bread. But at the moment, it's a bit of a problem. Because I can't actually make bread. Come on. We almost there. I mean, I don't need you guys, but welcome. Welcome to the colony. Because right now, this isn't a kingdom. This is a colony. It's not even a town yet. Come on. Oh, we are so close. I like how it's like, you're warded 50 planks. It's like, yay. The stuff I've been making and selling constantly. Give me 50 of those when I've already sold several hundred of them. <laughs> oh, so close. Come on. Once we... I'm sorry. Why did that drop to zero? I was right there, you dick of a game. <laughs> like that was so unnecessary to take that away from me. Just sell. Hmm. Like, we should not have a hard time reaching this. I'm honestly not sure what's keeping us from reaching it actively at this point in time. One ninety, thank you. What we need are the merchants to come here more frequently. I mean, I guess I could just buy some more land and hope for the best. You know, it wouldn't hurt, actually. Uh, as much as I don't want to do this, it wouldn't hurt to put another merchant hut here for food and clothing once we get it. And it would definitely help us with the cash. So let's see about doing that. I want to see if we can hit it without doing another merchant hut, though. Ah, uh, it's not looking like it. Come on. Yes, no. That's going to reset to zero any second now. Well, crap. Fine. I was hopeful. But it's not going to happen. Not at the moment. So let's just do this. Start construction. And once those are ready, I can tell it to have food. and I can tell it to sell food and clothing, even though we don't have the clothing yet. I know. But the extra merchant, yeah, we wouldn't have made it if I hadn't have spent that gold anyway. So yeah, let's do this. 
And we've got enough new villagers that I can get this up and running immediately. Come on. Oh, I know you can do this. Soonish. Maybe. <laughs> All I need is this to be done. 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 <laughs> ah. Uh, food. And clothing. Get to it. Make me that money so I can reach my weekly profit margins. And new house is going to be nice. It'll be even nicer if you guys let me hit 500 profit a week. It'd be really cool of you guys. <laughs> the game doesn't care. <laughs> I mean, the money's going up faster than it has been recently, so... Not too concerned. God damn it. I am now. Went from 370 to 315. Even though I didn't spend any money. Those were my taxes, I'm assuming. Money grubbing kingdom wants my money. My money. Not their money. My money. Hmm. Apparently my people aren't really all that angry about, like, the lack of a church or anything like that. Oh, we're close. Oh, you mother... Nah! <laughs> hmm. Anybody else I can trade with? <laughs> this, is getting, this is getting aggravating. Well, we built up real fast right there, and then it all went away. Hmm. Where should we expand? I mean, I know I already expanded here. I could expand over here, and that would let me put in, like, three more marketplaces. Wouldn't be a bad approach to expand here. Especially since the game is ba is um, keeping me from getting that 500. Almost seems like it's actively working against me. Hmm. I'm going to do... I'm actually going to expand over here. Yeah, I already bought this land. Might as well use it for something. And I might just put a little woodcutter's hut down here to clear this area of everything. And it's really hard to see that extraction zone in there. But yeah, I might put a lumber camp down here just to clear this area out. Oh, come on. All right. Let's see. If this drops down to zero, then, yeah, I'll just go all out building up this slot right here. Please don't drop back down to zero. Just spike. Spike to 500. <sighs> okay. Is not gonna. So I'm gonna put a lumber camp here. I'm gonna put a well... Well, frankly... I'm gonna put a well on both ends of this place. Then a gather... We're gonna put a couple gathering huts. Put like three gathering huts like that. And I'm just gonna let these guys just 
go to town just cutting all these trees. There's not going to be any reforestation over here. Not if I can help it. There we go. Fully crude. And it can just take its time annihilating all this. The wells are in place. Yeah, as long as we leave the coastal area here alone so we can uh, build the fishing huts, you know, if and when we get them. I'm not going to do the residential painting yet. Food shouldn't be a problem for a while. Hasn't been a problem, but just saying. Should get a few more people up here. Yeah, I'm on. What do you guys want? You want berries, okay. I'll help the king. Take your berries, king. I need more immigrants. As many as I can get. Uh, might as well get to work on the markets as well. Put one here with a goods mark to it. Start construction. I want to build another one. Do it right here. Then a goods market, and we'll do that right here. Start construction on that as well. I mean, I don't have the people to man these spots. Well, now I do. As soon as they get built, at least. Should make for a very good recreation, uh, recreation, uh, residential zone. Let's take a look. Boom. They like this area now. So we're going to open it up. Except I want to trim this out. I don't want it to go too close to the water, you know? The splendor of your village, oh, has unlocked a new tier of unlockables. Ah, so I didn't have to do uh, this quest. Cool. Thank you. Food? Clothing. Now, what did I get? What can I build now? Oh, decorative bushes and fences. <laughs> I mean, I guess they're nice. I mean, I could do better if you gave me a stonemason. And I know what we're waiting on. It is... It definitely has to be this quest. Come on. Can I buy polished stone? No. Not from any of my trading partners. Holy crap, okay. New market done. No way to actually trade with it, but hey. Come on. Keep cutting these trees to make room for homes. You know, but also, let's get some new people here.
The sooner I can get people assigned to this, the better. Yeah, I'm not joking. <laughs> Lord, we just lost a huge chunk. Of it. We got a huge chunk of it back, but we lost a huge chunk. Thank you for that, my villager friends. You're so close, man. We've been hovering just under 500 with our last couple weekly profits. Son of a... <laughs> uh. <laughs> We should be able to do this, though. Yeah, it's going to drop down to zero again. It sucks so bad. If only I could sell the clothing, which I can't do until you let me have... See, we we're at like 476. <laughs> I can't sell my clothing till you let me have polished stone. You guys don't want me to have polished stone. It's a conspiracy at this point. It's what's starting to feel like. <laughs> uh, back to zero. I mean, we are making plenty of room for houses, though. Our population of 100% serfs <coughs> at least live okay. We're off to an early start. And we'll probably get to like 470 something and then nosedive back down to zero. If necessary, I'll use the 500 gold to just buy another plot of land. We'll just keep expanding with serfs. Eventually, something's got to give. If I build enough berry markets. Try not to stare at it, because when I stare at it, yeah, it drops from 458 to 398. <laughs> this game's a bit of a dick sometimes, isn't it? It's like, oh, oh, you're close. No, no. Can't have it. Four fifty-seven, four sixty. 460. Oh, you son of a mother. <laughs> oh. I hate you. Even just one trader coming in buying some stuff. Just a handful of stuff. Why must you take my gold like that? Four ninety. Oh, if you drop to zero. Hey, we did it. We've got. We went beyond it. Oh, don't you drop to zero. We were over five hundred. Don't you dare, you. Ooh, don't you dare. Isn't that like we succeeded? Just give me the success message. Okay, thank you. Don't mess around like that game. Hmm. So we have no quests at the moment. So how do we upgrade to the next level? Oh, I can spend points. Yeah, let's unlock a fisher's hut. I don't care about wooden keeps and walls. I don't care about church additions at the moment. What point are you guys going to give me commoners? What the stonemason? How do I get the stonemason? Stone what? No, it's not a mason, that's for sure. No. Nah. Okay, it's none of that. I gotta wait.
Fisher's hut. Wait, I okay. I was about to say, can I just build the? I, wow, I can. Seems a little weird, but. Here. I'll put one of you here. Maybe we'll put one of you here. That seems like it would work. Let's welcome the new villagers. Okay, we don't have any more to work in the huts, that's fine. I really just want some commoners. Do I need to build the church before I can get the commoners? I mean, if I have to, I have to, but I'd really rather not have to. Okay, only one fisherman per structure. That works. Um, I shall help the people. There we go. <laughs> okay, I need one more dude. One more dude to sell the fish. That's all. Just one more dude. Not to sell the fish, but to catch the fish. I don't even need to expand this area all that much. Okay, now. Do we have another villager yet? No. Do we have a commoner yet? No. Hmm. I feel like if I'm going to build, like, a rustic church, I should probably, like, take this hex right here. And that will be the rustic church. I don't mean the expenses, man. Oof. I don't want to add that much to my my gold penalty. You guys are insane. That'd be expensive. How do I not have the fishermen yet? Gimme. I could unlock the Lord Manor. Sure, let's unlock the Lord Manor. Let's unlock everything that we can. Let's see, we are allowing you to establish an outpost on your territory. On your territory, thus you'll be able to participate in military campaigns for your liege. It's a privilege. Don't forget about it. Uh, build a wooden keep. Okay. I'm not sure when we'll be able to do that, but I'll I'll, I'll work on it. Put this away. Sign a villager. I was told villagers were forthcoming. And here they come. Good. Oh, I actually like that they run out on their little boats to do their job. Done. Okay, now we need to assign somebody here. Just cut these last couple trees down, and then I will relieve you from these jobs. Just this tree right here, dude. This tree right here. Not those trees. This tree. 
Because I would like to bulldoze this lumber camp. I don't need it. It is an unnecessary lumber camp. As soon as I've seen these guys have been re uh, removed. Should happen any minute now. Another two. Come on. One more. One more. Yes. Get rid of them. I think what we're going to do is we're going to build, because I like having one in every area. Build a warehouse. This one is going to be for fish. Other stuff can be stored here, but primarily fish. And berries. And clothing, as a matter of fact, for our traders. For our merchant. All right, we need to buy land, though. So as soon as we get back up to 500 gold, I'm going to buy this land. Just that 500. Okay, now we can drop down to 383. Okay, the game. you're messing with me again, game. I can see that. Welcome, new villagers. I do have work for you to do. First, I need land. This land. Right here. Thank you. Now. I should be able to add... Yes. Those two. Here comes two more villagers. Please. Please? There we go. Uh, fish. Fish. Berries. Clothing. And then the last one could be for whatever. Now, let's paint this. Uh, extraction. Everything can be extracted. That's how we do things here. <laughs> we have set districts. And I'll build a... Probably the wooden keep over here, or maybe even just the rustic church. Then maybe we get some commoners. Kind of what I'm aiming for, the commoners. However, we see a couple of the workspaces we need over here. So, first things first. Let's just throw a lumber camp and a stone cutter camp over here, just right off the bat. Now, wooden keep. Or rustic church. So that's the core of the rustic church? Okay. That's the other core of the rustic church. Hmm. Ah, that's how you make it bigger. Hmm. I don't want to make it that big. But I do want to build a decent rustic church to keep my people happy. But the church might be what goes on the river. And the keep comes out here somewhere. Provides defense to the village. I'll say name the Lord's Manor is just a defensive structure. Hmm. Well, maybe let's put that over here. I 
I can always edit this later, from what I understand. I'll make quite tall. Hmm. Yeah, let's make one. How does one attach a door to this? Hmm. Interesting. Oh. Oh, so basically I'm not building a keep, I'm building a guard tower. What's the other top? Ooh, more ornate. I'll go with that. So now... Trying to find the door. That is not the door. There it is. Do that. We can do that type of door, or that type of uh, stairway. Let's do this one. I kind of feel like putting this like right next to the road. I can't help any of you. Be gone. Let's build it right up here. It's a nice defensive tower. I kind of feel like building another one now. And you know what? The game is okay with that. Oh, man. Fine. Where do I attach the gate, then? Well, fine. Whatever. <laughs> you just... Oh. Apparently, I can put it wherever the hell I please. I thought I had to be within my territory. Just build it right here. It's fine. I'm really not sure where they want the gate to go. Alright. Start construction, I guess. We need two tools and 130 planks. That's gonna take a while. But I guess we can get attacked. Nice. There's three people right off the bat to start chopping down trees. Bit more stone, it's always welcome. I wonder at what point like we can build walls from that. 100's hut, really? I want some hunter's huts. I need commoners first, but <laughs> I honestly don't know what's keeping me from actually being able to reach, you know, the hunter's hut. I mean, sorry, the commoner level. Maybe that's what I need the Lord's Manor for. I don't want to build the Lord's Manor over here, though. I want to build the Lord's Manor, like, right here. Like, just taking up this entire river area. I might build the church like here though. Ooh. Might also be fun to build the Lord's Manor straddling the river. That's a really cool piece of land. I might do that. Well, let's get the keep built first and make our king happy.
He is almost done, though. It does really look cool. Bring the planks. Honestly, I feel like I need more builders. All of our people are too busy to bring planks, apparently. This is for your own good. Prioritize this nonsense. You'll be glad you did. When the attacks come, I don't know if attacks are coming or not, just saying. Hmm. Come on. I mean, we have plenty of these berries sitting around now. Don't think we have to worry about any shortage on that front anymore. Just brought a whole lot more. Oh, hey, we got everything we need. So now this tower's, this wooden keep's about to be finished. Come on. Finish it. You're almost there. You are indeed almost there. When these people get here, one becomes a stone cutter. The other one's going to become a builder. Here they come. I'm also wondering why Richard's not actually building my... Hey, um keep. Oh, he is now. It's good to see. The kingdom has noticed your keep and might call on you in a military campaign. I shall think about training soldiers then. I really won't. I need my people. But I can assign soldiers to it. Don't know why I would ever do that. Barbara, become a builder. Wonder. Okay, I have four builders. I think that's good for now, for builders. Still no commoners, huh? Yeah, I'm starting to feel like it's the either the Lord's Manor or the church. Let's find out. Yeah, villagers. Construction, production, zoning, and good luck. Okay. The help menu was far from actually helpful. So I might build the Lord's Manor down here once the trees have been cleared because the Lord's Manor being next to the keep kind of a good idea and then I can just build the church and stuff like that over here or I might just put the church over here I honestly do not know yet <laughs> either way though with this I am all out of time for today so thank you everybody so very much for watching and if you enjoyed this video at all then please by all means feel free to like comment subscribe or any combination of those actions that suits you today and with that I'll see you guys next time for some more foundation. Thanks again for watching.